Where is Scott Lang? Well, see, that's complicated. Because when I first met Scotty, he was in a bad place. And I'm not talking about Cell Black D. His wife had just filed for divorce. And I was like, damn, homie, she dumped it when you're on lockup. And he was like, yeah, I know. I thought I was going to be with her forever. But now I'm all alone. And I was like, damn, homie, you know what? You got to chin up because you'll find a new partner. But you know what? I'm Luis. And he says, you know what? I'm Scotty. And we're going to be best friends. Okay, hold on, hold on. I like a good story as much as the next person, but what in the hell does this have to do with where Scott Lang is? I'm getting there, I'm getting there. You put a dime in him, you gotta let the whole song play out. He's like human jukebox. Ant-Man and the Wasp. And Louise. With a PG-13. Hi, I'm Evangeline Lilly. I'm Paul Rudd. And we have... A big announcement. Come on, guys. Seriously? Well played. Gotta respect that. It is a good bit. <laughs> Hey there, Internet. Hey! We're here to tell you about our... New... Two heroes... Team up? Guys, I'm sorry. I mean, we just, we can't read this. <laughs> it's impossible. I mean, I get it. Look, it's... Thank you. Oh, I got it. In three days. Man, man in the watch. Team up. Hey, IMAX fans. Yeah, no, down here. Hey, it's me. I'm, um, can you zoom in? Can you zoom in? Really? Oh, well, okay, well, whatever. Uh, Paul Rudd here. And uh, I want to tell you that if you want to see the biggest slash smallest film of the year in the most immersive theater, you've got to experience it in IMAX July 6th. Get your tickets today. Really? You can't zoom in? I'm the, I'm the star of the movie. How, how will they know that I'm not Chris Hemsworth? What do you mean they'll know? So, how long have you been Ant-Man again? Ant-Man and the Wasp is really the next chapter in the Ant-Man saga, and it is really about the search for Janet Van Dyne, the original Wasp. And it's also the first time we see uh, Hope Van Dyne, played by Evangeline Lilly, as the hero Wasp. You gave her wings and blasters. So I take it you didn't have that tech available for me? No, I did. Well, it's amazing because we've, um, we shot in this uh, 65 millimeter format, which is huge and beautiful. And the movie, the aspect ratio is 235. But for IMAX, we specifically designed uh, large chunks of the movie to be in the 1-9 aspect ratio for IMAX. And it looks incredible. I mean, it really puts you in the movie for, for all of it, for the, for the Ant-Man stuff, for the Wasp, and for Giant Man. It really is, you know, you just get, you get into so much more picture, and it's, it's incredible. Ant-Man and the Wasp teaming up. You know, there's a scene where um, Hank Pym's shrunken lab is taken by a guy named Sonny Birch, played by Walton Goggins. He's hiding away on a whale-watching boat, and Ant-Man flies out to, to try and catch him. Ant-Man is temporarily foiled, but then appears as Giant Man the largest incarnation of Giant Man. And in IMAX is incredible because it really plays the top and bottom and you really get a sense of how large Giant Man is. Hey, what'd I miss? We were just tiny. 